So the Fulgans purchased the Tudor house. It needed a bit of restoration. They found a cellar underneath where the downstairs bathroom was to go, a well underneath the footings for the new extension, and now it would appear that they've been digging again. Let's find out. <laughs> Oh, hello. You all right? Yeah. Is your mum and dad around? Yeah. Can I come in? Can we come in? Yeah. Hey. Hello. How are you doing? Yeah, all right. Long it's, time, no see. It's been a while, hasn't it? Yeah. And this place has changed a bit as well. <laughs> well, what do you think? Well, you've ripped another floor you've up. Ripped another floor up. I know, that's a really recent decision. The first time I came into this room, I remember it clearly because it was like plaster all hanging off that wall there. Yeah. And it was just like, just picking it away. And now the whole floor's come up. I know, we should have done it earlier, but we decided we were going to put underfloor heating down. Okay. So we took okay. the floor up and then the concrete, and now we've got to dig down. Let's see, we have a look at the new extension. So there was a wall here and a window. Yep. So we keep having to move stuff around, depending on which room we're in. So this will be the kitchen. Okay. So yeah, put the roof on, just to finish that the week before Christmas. And then we had, there's been delays waiting for windows and things because of supply issues. But this is up, ready to go. That's good. And you've still got the access in the to corner, the well. Yeah. Behind all the stuff. You've managed to go back down there and clean it out? Not yet, not? no. I've got no. to, but I haven't done that yet. <laughs> I'm putting that off. It's a bit narrower gap now. <laughs> There's some, something looks different here. I think it's because that's so, yeah, filled in now. So yeah, we've been boarding everything out, putting insulation in. We've taken a bit of wall out there as well. That's what's different. Yeah. So there was a bit of wall that wasn't attached to anything. That's, uh, actually, that's made so much more room here, hasn't yeah, it? Yeah, well, now we've done that. We've, I'm not sure whether we're going to put it back. Maybe push the lounge back a Because wasn't that where Stu wanted the TV to go well, on that Well, that's the only problem. There isn't really anywhere to put the TV. Well, who needs a TV? Oh, wall. <laughs> okay. But yeah. So um, there's so a lot more digging going on in here as well. So yeah, downstairs. This hasn't, <laughs> apart from the digging. The, graf the yeah. grafters are giving it, uh, giving I it know, some there. Showing off now. But yeah, we thought we'd found a floor ready to go yesterday. But um, so yeah, it was f like a brick floor. I think it was like a fire pit or hearth or something. Right. There's loads of ash all over it. Got a new roof. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Yeah, windows ready. It's calm. Yeah. So much neater. Yeah, just don't look at the rest of it. She was just in painting the barge she wants you to compliment those. Oh, very nice. <laughs> Great job, Stu. It's like the first sunny weekend we've had, though, to do anything outside. It's been like a mud bath out here all winter. Has it been moving along quite well of late, apart from the fact that you said you were struggling with supplies? Yeah, it's just trying to fit it around work and yeah. life and everything else. But yeah, so over Christmas, we kind of really decided we needed to move it on, so... And when do you think you're going to be finished? Well, we really want to be ready by, like, June. <laughs> so now that's mostly boarded, so... Um, yeah, I've been building walls. So we've got a bit of pointing going on. Get that finished. But yeah, uh, so all of this stuff so fiddly. It's taken ages, but... Actually, I, I mean, it's amazing how that's all filled in, because I didn't... I couldn't see how you were going to do it, yeah. if I'm honest. Well, we did the bottom half, and Brendan did the difficult Yeah. <laughs> that must have been some job. Yeah, because every bit's different. You just had to sort of measure it around all the beams yeah. and go behind that. It's all relative. And then the bathroom. Yeah, so we've got a new window. We started putting some of the oh, yeah. okay. pipe runs in. Well, we, Stuart has. Um, so yeah, there's lots of space to put the cable. I'm gonna put all the cable in along these beams and then box them in once it's all Good up. idea, yeah. And then try and yeah. put a lot of the fittings on the new walls because we can put the cables and yeah. inside. What's been the most challenging thing of late then? I think the most challenging thing is just the, the time that we need to spend on it. Well, that's not a bad challenge though, is it? At least, you know, you haven't got to empty out another well or no, uh, dig no, out another cellar. No, there's not been any, just the floor. Or, or fix a load of rotten wood. <laughs> yeah, no, all of that's fixed, so it is just planning all the different bits that need to yeah. happen next. So, yeah, same way, so just... Watch your head, Mr Cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, just finishing the boarding in here. 
these these are original. Oh, I see. Watling door, but they sort of shrunk and yeah, I think because it's mainly held together with this wood chip. <laughs> yeah. So um, and then we need to plaster over it, but we just need to find out what to do to fill in the gaps. But that's not major. It's good to see you digging again, though. <laughs> I mean, there can't be many more holes left, can there? No, you think so, but we said that before. <laughs> and then we've got a bathroom just... Another little shower room. So for ages, we've just been moving stuff around because we've ordered so many materials because we were worried we wouldn't be able to get timber and stuff and because mm. the prices have just been going crazy. Yeah. But then the whole house was yeah, full of wood, stuff. The cost of woods cost of shot woods through the roof, and, hasn't yeah. it? Yeah. Um, but we still didn't order enough. But yeah, so then we just spend most of the time moving piles of wood and plasterboard and stuff around yeah. to make space for the next bit of work you're still enjoying it yeah it's yeah or is it's it at that point now where you just want it done no well, a bit of both yeah. yeah we do want it done but yeah. i quite like this bit mm. but yes it's gone on quite a long time yeah brendan suggested having a normal size door inside a frame but I decided that would be a bit dangerous because you'd yeah. be lulled into a false sense of security because you've quite often hit your head on this haven't you Stu? on many occasions Me. Well, you can tell how long we've been doing it because the girls now Scarlett fitted in that door frame when we started, and now she bangs her head. So, how's Stuart finding the project? It's, All right. Yeah. All right. I'm a bit frustrated today, so. How are you? A bit grumpy. <laughs> more well, grumpy, we more have, grumpy than usual. We can all have grumpy days, mate, can't we? Yeah, that's true. Yeah. How are you doing? Mate? I'm doing all right. Apart from I've got a bad back. Have you? Yeah. Oh, so oh and you've not even been doing any digging. No, I was making a cardboard maze for a hamster. Amazing, <laughs> 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 though. On the back, that uh, did did you get to finish it? Gonna, yeah, I finished oh, it, good. but it's quite a big maze. So I, mean, I think I was just, I just leant over slightly wrong and mm. something went. And I've been agony, in agony I think basically it's always for about doing two weeks that. now. Oh, that's, well, that's not that's good. Really yeah. So. But the hamster's happy. The hamster's great, yeah. Well, enough about all this hamster chat. Hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, please hit that thumbs up, comment below, and if you're feeling extra generous, subscribe to the channel for future notifications. 